Hello everyone, today I'm gonna to show you how um, when you create a deployment with some number of re replicas, how evenly they get, all the pods get distributed into the nodes. Uh, it's it's really uh, something to see because it's so, it happens so quickly and it's so, it happens so um, easily and reliably. Um, so I, I'm connected to a cluster right now. It has five nodes. By the way, K is just an alias for kubectl. Mess that up. So I have a cluster with five nodes, and I'm going to create uh, a um, deployment with five replicas. I don't want to. I don't want to memorize anything, so I'm just going to look that up. Create deploy minus h for help. And it gives me several examples. One of them has replica sets. So, for example, this one. I'm going to take that one. And modify it. Let me go this a little better to see. I'm going to create five replicas. It's already created. Let's look at the pods. Already running. If I do output wide, meaning give me more, more information about each pod, it tells me which pod they're running in. As you can see, B, C, another one, 8B, and then J and H. Each pod is automatic, automatically running on a different nodes, and there happens to be five nodes, there happens to be five pods, they're evenly distributed. It is uh, super easy to configure, it happens automatically, uh, and it's just, it's just it's a very reliable process in the Kubernetes uh, infrastructure. Hope this was useful to you. If, there were, if it was, please like and, like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.